This video is sponsored by One Six Scale Society. Join an international group for One Six Scale Collecting. Link is in the description. They are awesome. What up, big kids? Here's your big news flash. While Hot Toys is revealed, their next Spider-Man Homecoming movie masterpiece, One Six Scale Collectible figure, and we get two versions. And of course, it's of Spider-Man in his main suit, the Tony Stark suit, whatever you want to call it. This figure looks absolutely amazing, not to be confused with Amazing Spider-Man. I did love that suit, but this suit I love even more, and there's so many cool features on this. This will have a newly developed interchangeable head sculpt. Um, it'll have four pairs of interchangeable Spider-Man eye pieces, like kind of like what they did with Deadpool, which is really cool. So uh, you can kind of mix and match and have Spider-Man's eyes you know, look like how he did in the comics. He'll have over 30 points of articulation, 10 interchangeable hands with a pair of fists, a pair of relaxed hands, a pair of cobweb shooting hands, cobweb swinging, a pair of open hands. Um, He'll have his costume, magnetic web wings. Uh, he'll have his boots, and he has a Spider-Man mask that's not wearable. Um, web effect accessories, five strings for web effects. His backpack, headphones, signs, textbook, uh, spider signal stickers. So, and he'll have a nameplate with movie logo. So you can get the regular version for two hundred and thirty dollars, but there's a deluxe version that uh, comes with a couple accessories. You get a blue zip up hoodie, a yellow blazer with badge, and a uh, vulture helmet that's not wearable, but you can display it. So that one will be two hundred and fifty two dollars. So for an extra like twenty bucks, you get you know a, a couple wearable accessories and the vulture helmet. I think if you're trying to do this kind of look with uh, Spider-Man looking like, you know, he's listening to music and stuff, I think that's cool. But otherwise, I would probably just stick with the regular version. I hope we get a Vulture. I hope it's not just like what happened with Captain America. We get the helmet, but we still don't get the Crossbones uh, figure yet. I still want that Crossbones figure. But yeah, Vulture, I hope they really do. I know the wings would be crazy. I don't know really how they could do that because if you've seen the marvel legends figure those wings are crazy so yeah i mean they did it with falcon but you know, vulture's wings are even bigger so but i'm really excited for this figure i've been wanting this figure since Ca uh, captain america civil war i can definitely see people getting two of these to put in their civil war display and then a spider-man homecoming like i said i don't know if the deluxe versions were really worth it for those extra accessories but um yeah, compared to the rocket where it had a different head sculpt, but you are getting two head sculpts and one of those have interchangeable eyes. So I think the regular version is just fine and I can't wait to, to have this Spidey. So what do you kids what do you big kids think? Are you gonna get the hot toys uh, Spider Man from Spider Man Homecoming? Do you love it? Do you hate it? For the full pick gallery and pre order information go to Sideshow Collectibles and for more check out my website at SeanNixLong.com. Also check out One Six Scale Society, link is in the description. Uh, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, links in the description. I'm Sean Long, Mayor Live Long and Love Life. When the Empire sends giant armored camels to destroy your rebel base and your snow speeder, you need